Hi everybody, my name is Keaton and welcome back to another episode of my Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. In the last episode, we just continue on to do some side quests, including uh, uh, the, you know, ousting the giants, which is the three brothers of Hanox. Uh, today we're going to continue on as what we're going to be doing. Uh, yes, it's, there's a thunderstorm right now, but luckily I went inside. Uh, I want to talk to Beetle, uh, what have you got? I want to buy more arrows because I'm going to need some more. If, I've probably, even though I, I think I have a lot, like 125, is that? Yep, 125. So yeah, we're going to get started with the, the empty frame. Uh, yes, the, there's a empty one. Oh. We stable owners are going to be putting paintings on display for everyone to enjoy. The stable association figure would be a good idea for us to hang the frames first to get ready. I spent a while mulling over that what painting could be worthy of such a nice frame. Here's my thought. When it's clear out, which granted isn't often around these parts, you could get a beautiful view of Flora Foria Falls. The best place to see it, it is Floria Bridge outside the stable. Wouldn't a view from there make a nice painting? Aww. Problem is, I can't leave the stable unattended, and even if I could, it's rare that I that the weather is clear enough. But maybe there's some other way to get a panoramic view of Floria Falls on a clear day. If someone brought me a picture, for instance, then I'd be able to paint a copy and hang that up in the frame. Well, I might help you with that one, so if I want to make it a day, oh. uh, I'm gonna sleep, but I'm just, oh. I'm just gonna do regular bed. Uh, you know, I'll just use another ticket, why not? Do morning. Oh. I want to sleep till like five, probably like five hours of sleeping. <laughs> mm. Alright. Oh. Oh. I think that's much better, hopefully. Hold on. I want to go to where the, the star stamp is at. So that way... Oh yeah, there's Addison. I'm gonna have to go through. I'll, I'll, I'll talk to him and help him out with the signs. In just a sec, I, I need to take a picture of this first. Okay, excuse me guys, I'm trying to get a best picture here, so... There you go. Alright, got the picture up. Now it's Addison sign time. Yay. Oh yes, we have a Korok here. Okay. Looks like we have looks like we have everyone in mind. Uh let's see here. I think what I should I think what it looks like. Alright, come on. I wanna shake my joy cons to get it to work. <laughs> wow, why is it like shaking a lot? I'll just put it up like that. Maybe that's when I could just put whatever. Maybe I could put this one underneath. Alright, I'll get. Hold on. Just be patient, you guys. Okay. Whoa, what the heck? No, stop. You're doing it wrong. Listen, what I meant to put up... Okay, what the heck is going on? Dude, I'm trying to put this underneath. Okay. So I'm just gonna... Let me do this for like a for like a long probably like minutes or seconds. Just to hold it up straight like that. Because maybe that should hold it still. Like I wanna say it should.
Okay, come on. I'm trying here if this... Okay. How about I grab this one, put it right here. Alright. Try letting go. Try letting go. Let's see where it's gonna fall. Oh, okay. It just holds it still like that. Okay. Brilliant indeed. Alright, go ahead and get that sign building. So there we go. Alright. I'll be taking what's mine. Like, yes, red rupees worth 20. <laughs> Story made me rice balls. Thank you. And a sleepover ticket. Thank you. Alright. Alright, well... See ya. Alright. Now it's this Korok. It's what is up. Do you know where your friend is, are? Oh, okay. Uh, I could just cross the bridge to get there. This won't be- this won't be Brava. We just gotta cross the bridge and get to, uh, you know, get to its friend there. That's what it's important that we can do. Something what we can do in order to, you know, I would say probably just get another Korok seed. Oh yeah, I think this part from Breath of the Wild, if you stand here, that's when you do do the, the shooting for the Korok seeds. Alright, so we're probably getting close. We're probably getting close already, so that's good. Because yeah, what I'm seeing is the 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 green smoke signal. That's when we need to go there. Alright. I'll watch I'm gonna watch out from the Elizabeth though. I have to watch out from the enemies. Cause cause they can like harass me. For rude for rude reason, you could say. But alright, here's your friend. There you go. What I what did I say? This no, this won't be bad. So there we go. I think I'm at 705 now, so that's great. Thank you. So now we got that out of our way, well, let's go make ourselves way back to the stable and do the picture frame. And after that, then uh, we're gonna move on to the next one. I think I'll do the the Highland as I'm looking as I'm looking up and having my game guide to help me out on where the another side quest I need to go to. Hopefully at some point I will do the Koroks, like I say I should, because I feel- because I'm at like 126 side quests, which which I'm getting really close now. I'm so close to get 139 to, to complete the side quest. Because after that, then all that's left for me to do is find all the Koroks, which it's gonna be great, honestly. I might need help with that, so hopefully I'll, I'll look up real hard to tell me where to- other tower where the other Kor Koroks are at when I go to the next tower for the location. So okay, right now we're gonna like come inside right here. So we can look at the picture frame again. So yeah, I still have an eye on the empty frame, but good news, I got the picture for you. Because I just took a picture for you this morning. Oh. Like this one? No. Did you bring me a picture of Floria Falls on a clear day? Can I see it? Sure. Go ahead and take a look. Oh. Aha! This is exactly the picture I asked for. This would really live up the look around here. Is it okay if I paint a copy? Sure. Uh -huh. Thank you. Ah, the falls really pack a punch. No matter how many times I see them, I'm always moved beyond words. That picture will make travelers glad they made the long, slippery trip to Faron. Now just give me a moment to whip up a reproduction. Haha, <laughs> don't worry, I'm quite good at this. I promise. Right, I'll keep it in mind for this. So there you go. I uh, just... There you go, get the painting. 
I knew it. it's perfect for this stable, and it's all thanks to you, Link. Mm. Stunning, isn't it? That said, if you ever want to want me to hang a different picture of Floria Falls on a clear day, I'll be happy to oblige. Uh, yeah. Just show me the next new picture. I'll paint up paint up a copy and display it instead. To show my appreciation, I'm giving you one pony point. Ooh. Oh yes, please take this too. This dish is a special is it or this dish is a staple speciality. And it has a tough tomato seafood soup. Hmm, that sounds yummy. Oh. It looks yummy too. Oh Link, it looks like you've saved up some pony points. Indeed I did. Oh. Thank you for a truly splendid picture. Please feel free to use the stable whenever you want. Alright. I will. So there you go, we've completed the side quest. So now that's 127 completed it. I will delete the stamp here. I just put them down to help me out. All right, next one I'm gonna be heading to is the Highland, if I could. Yeah, there you go. This is the Highland I wanna go to. So let us go travel to a Highland stable for another picture. So here we are. I'm gonna be heading to the, you know, I'm just gonna be heading to the Highland stable. Oh yeah, it's actually there. I I was I thought it was like whichever direction I'm heading to, but I would say I meant to come like here. So yeah, meant to come like here. Oh yes, yeah, so we're having a lot of music band going on. Huh. Yes, another empty frame caught my eyes. Which I would say eyes than just one eye, you could really say. Oh. We stable owners are going to be putting paintings on display for everyone to enjoy. The stable association figured it'd be a good idea for us to hang the frames first to get ready. It's such an impressive frame. It's sure to be the focus of the stable, but now I need an impressive painting to go inside it. I was thinking, I heard this rumor the other day about this rare horse, this giant white stallion. Uh -huh. Sounds impressive, doesn't it? I mean, a white horse is pretty rare, but a giant one, and it lives nearby, they say. A picture of an impressive creature like a giant white stallion would suit that frame perfectly, I'm sure of it. Uh -huh. Of course, the folks who told me about this horse hasn't actually seen it with their own eyes yet. They were planning to take the road to the Lake of the Course God southeast of here and search for it there. Aww. If I knew for sure it was there, I would go try to get a look at it. Uh, but I can't leave work for a rumor. I wish I had some kind of picture of that giant white stallion. If I did, I'd use it for reference and whip up a painting of it. Well, I think I'm gonna help you out with that part. Alright, let's go. So it's gonna be at the... yeah. Down here, I think, I think probably somewhere here at the lake is when you can find a giant white horse stallion. I guess that's what you can find. Oh, that's the oh yeah, that's the Korok tent that I, that I already did. All right. I just want to take a good look on the map to make sure I know where I'm heading to. Because it's important for me to take a look at the map, just to make sure I know if I'm heading the right direction. Because that would suck if I went for the wrong direction for the game. So let's see. So it's probably down here? The white giant horse? Unless if it would be at the where the gods Unless if it's up there actually. Maybe I have to go there. Alright. Oh look, I wonder if that's it. I wonder if that's the one. Oh, a paraglider fabric. Cut the picture of a horse. Oh, 
All right. Oh, okay. So I, I guess that's not them actually. Sorry. I thought it was, but I was wrong. Oh wait, that must be the one. Let's get a little bit closer. Yeah, the millennia used to be there in Breath of the Wild, but now it's at the uh, cacao somewhere. Nice. All right, that concludes like a, a fabric. Uh, I don't know why it shows me a fabric. Maybe they have something in mind. I wonder if I would talk, must be captured. It's huge and impossible. I guess they would give me a fabric if I captured a giant horse. I don't know, but I think it's best to just yeah, I don't, I don't really care about the fabric too much, honestly. Uh, all I care about is just uh, find all the... All I care about right now is just get all the side quests complete. And I think there's this spot. Ah, there you go, I see. Here's something that can, uh, that can give me a Korok. Okay, let's put that... Uh, let's put it here. Oh gosh, no, no. Ooh, I see. I'm like, no, don't fall on me. Okay. There we go. Hi there. Alright. I think seven seven hundred and six. I'm gonna have to look up really good when I when I get to the loading screen from traveling. But it is pretty but I'll go ahead and delete. I'll delete one. I'll keep the, the the white stallion horse. That's what I will do. That's what I'll keep. I mean, you could capture it and have it as your pet if you want. Uh, but I'm just gonna take a picture as it is. So yeah, let's go back inside. So we're gonna take a look at the the empty frame again, as this time I have a picture frame for the the giant white stallion horse. All right, here is a picture. Are you serious? You're going to show me the white the giant white stallion? Can I see it? Sure. Go ahead and take a look, because I already took a picture of it. This is exactly the picture I asked for. This would really live up the look around here. Is it okay if I paint a copy? Sure. Aww. Thank you. It, it gets more enchanting the more you look at it, doesn't it? Ah, such a fine horse. If only I could ride the giant white stallion, we would race across the wide plains. Mm -hmm. At my age, what's another dream to add to the pile, eh? Now just give me a moment to whip out a reproduction. Haha, <laughs> don't worry, I'm quite good at this, I promise. Alright, we'll get the painting going. So we can have ourselves a reward, you could say. And then we're going to move on to do another side quest. Ah. I knew it. It's perfect for the stable. It's all thanks to you, Link. Ah. Ah, what a sight for sore eyes. With that picture of a giant white stallion copied, I could probably display it whatever I want. Or if you'd rather I switch it for a different one, just show me the new picture. To show my appreciation, I'm giving you one pony point. Oh yes, and please take this too. This dish is a staple speciality, and that is the energizing honey creep, or honey crap. <laughs> that looks pretty yummy, honestly. Ah. Uh, yes, I did save up my points. Uh, so yeah, thank you for our truly splendid picture. Please feel free to use the staple whenever you want. All right, I will. Thank you for this. Okay, now we are done. I will go ahead and delete those since we are now done. Next, where I'm going to be heading to is the Gerudo, the Gerudo town. I'm going to go, go talk to Riju, because she might have something in mind about the other side quests. I did have 706 Koroks. I counted it, and the answer is I did have 706. Alright. 
let's go ahead and uh hey Riju I'm here hello let's talk to her so link I'm glad to see you here. Are you finding my new power as a sage helpful? Hmm. I haven't found any clue about the fifth sage yet, but I'm not about to give up. Uh. What? You found the fifth sage? Interesting. So she's an ancient zone I named Minoru. Oh. And even though she's not, she's lost her original body, she pledged to fight alongside us as the sage of spirit. I don't know if you'll find this information helpful, hmm. but after I became a sage returned to town, I discover an interesting ancient reference. Seek out the swordswoman upon the sand and look to where she points. There is treasure awaiting underground. That was written in an old document I discovered. Mm. I doubt it holds in any connection to Zelda, but it might be a clue to something. The swordswoman upon the sand, treasure underground. It could be worth looking into. Which... Huh? What? You already found it? Wow. I see. So the treasure was armor, alphalated with the ancient Gerudo. I knew you'd be able to find it. Take it with you and make good use of it. So treasure of the Gerudo Desert. So that was for the the helm one, which I'm going to show you. So there you go. That's like 128 or 29, something like that. I forget, but so that was, so that, so that's this one. I did scan my amiibo for it, so I probably... I probably did not find it, but that's okay. I'm happy that I that I did this. So let's see here, what we're gonna be doing next. Um, we're we're still gonna continue doing the Gerudo. We're gonna continue to do a side quest here in the Gerudo. And what we're gonna be going, actually, let's see. I think it's this way. Uh, oh yeah, to the star. So I'm just, don't mind I passed by. I think this way. Yeah, there we go. I'm going the right direction. There we go. So it's probably her right here. Unless... Or, hold on. Where is she? I think she... Uh, do I have to- do I have to come here at night time? Because if that's the case... You know what, I think I have to come here at night time, so... I'll probably, uh, I'm gonna go get some well, it's- well, it is afternoon right now. I think I have- I think if I could just make it at night time... Maybe... Maybe... Alright. Standard, please. Uh... Let's do like after sunset, cause that's like, cause that's like, in nighttime, like, nine o'clock p.m. I think that's when we can see both the Gerudo, which I say we should, unless if I'm heading the wrong one. Let's see. Let's see if I would find it or not. If it's not here, then it's probably somewhere else. Okay. Uh, okay, let's see. Maybe I'm supposed to go that spot. So I probably put the stamp with the wrong one, is what it looks like. Okay, well, I thought it was here, but it's actually the different one, so I'm gonna go... So I'm, I'm gonna have to go this way. Ah, there, there they are. That's what I was looking for. Mm. So... I heard there's a place out in the desert with huge statues. They are all facing each other. Have any of your customers ever mentioned seeing something like that while they're suffering the dunes? Mm. Hard to say. The desert has its share of statues and ruins, and of course, the upheaval really changed things too. Do you have any more information to go on? Maybe a map or something? Oh. I did have one, but the wind caught it and blew it off to who knows where. I knew for sure that it's in the eastern part of the desert, though, and like I said, the huge statues face each other. It helps to know it's in the east, but, well, the desert is really, really big. A customer. 
Sorry, I need to get back to work. If you figure out where you need to go, come back and see me. I'll be happy to rent a Santio to you for the trip. So we have a side quest to the ruins. So we're just gonna grab a... So that customer seemed to be having a really rough time. I wish there was some way I could help. But if she doesn't even know where she wants to go, there isn't much I can do. Oh, I'm sorry. This is my sand seal rental shop. You can rent a sand seal from me here. Sand seals can breeze through the desert with ease and an, are an essential way to get around. And all my trained ones have been cooped up in the shelter for a while, so they're full of energy, ready to go. Renting a sand seal costs 20 rupees, or if you're interested in a sleigh seal, a sand seal with a sleigh, it's 50 rupees. So we're gonna rent a sleigh for, let's see, I'll rent one. Aww. We're gonna do a sleigh seal. <laughs> Alright, and I hope you and your little sand seal have an amazing trip. Alright. So there we go. So now, after this, okay, there we go. Oh yeah, it's cold, but let's go ahead and talk to uh, Poke Key right here. Hey you, you look like you've done your fair share for exploring. Have you ever seen a massive ruins with huge statues facing each other? It'd be in the eastern part of the desert, I think. I lost my map, so I don't know exactly where they are. Does that, does that sound familiar? If if you know what I'm talking about, I appreciate if I I appreciate it if you could take me there on a sleigh on a sleigh seal. Exploration and expense were paid in advance, so I obviously reward you if you helped me. I'll take you there. Eh? Okay, let's not waste any more time. Can I go on? Can I go ahead and hop on a sleigh? Go ahead. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get going to those ruins relatively safely, if possible. All right, so now we gotta like. All right, so, so I'm gonna be running on this. Okay, let me go ahead and put on the yeah a sand uh, boots, and I want to put on my yeah I'm gonna put this on because because as of right now it's cold. So my game guide tells me to go. Uh, where is it? Oh yeah, right there. My game guide tells me to go like where the East Grudo ruins are. So you could really say that's when we need to go to. So let's go for a ride. We. Oh yeah, I forgot about dash. I totally forgot to hit the dash button to make it to make this uh, go slay faster. Don't worry, I'm I'm, I'm going as I can. All right, am I going right way? Okay, I should. Well, do not run into the choo-choo. I gotta be careful about the enemies. Choo-choo's are everywhere. Don't get me wrong about them. Okay, there's a there's a lizard plus, but we're just gonna ignore. All right, and we are now officially here. Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened? Careful, oh no. Oh, I thought I would make it. What happened? Did she, are we like back at the beginning? That would suck if we did. I think we have to do the beginning again. I was there though. That was close. I'm glad that neither of us was seriously injured, but could you please try to be a little safer? Yeah. Eh? Go ahead, let's try this again! Of course, we have to do the beginning. Well, that's just great. Well, let's try this again. Without, without getting, without getting, without running into an accident, like I just did. I was doing good though. I would have, if I would have go the test, if I would have go there already, I probably would have. Uh, I I just probably would have go there already. Yeah. 
So let's see. I'm gonna go this way. Oh yeah, where am I going? Am I even going the right way or something? Because I feel like I'm not. Alright. Okay. I think we're now getting close. Stop here! Alright, well, this is the spot we have come here for. Now we have found what we're looking for. First time failed, second time I did it. So we made it to the what we are here for. Whoa. Hey, look at that! Ah. Huge statues! They're facing each... Mm -hmm. hmm? There, this is another statue, right? It's fallen over the mm -hmm. Okay, I'm sure this is the place I, I was asked to investigate. Eh? Now that I'm here, I can really start my investigation. Oh, and of course, I have to reward you for your help. And as we get a silver rupee worth 100. <laughs> I can tell right away that this place will be worth a really thorough look. I've got my work cut out for me. It's already interesting. Well, Tom Sorry about that, guys. My video cut off on me again, like, froze on me. I don't like when it happens, but I'll go ahead and skip this one for now. <clears throat> and there we go. So we have completed to the ruined side quest. So I'm at like 129. So that's awesome because we're like, because we only, because I have 10 more left and then I'll be done with the side quests. And then I'll be moving on to find some Koroks that I'm going to do my, make sure I do my best to work hard on finding them. So let us go to the Kara Kara Bazaar. I mean, I could probably just uh, ride there with the sleigh, but but it's fine. Let's see here. I think it's this way. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There's a chest right here. I could reach. Oh wait. There. Yeah. There you go. Alright, where is... Oh, I found a Gerudo bow. Uh, I have so many bows. Like, I have so many duplex bow. Uh, I think I'll get rid of... Let's see here. Uh, I think I'll get rid of this bow. Alright. Alright, so she's supposed to be here. Okay. Am I... Unless if I'm heading the wrong way. Hey. Unless if she's supposed to be around till morning. My... Get my guess. I think I... I think I have to like... I don't know. I thought I would find a Gerudo soldier. Maybe... I'll sit... I'm gonna sit till like... Morning. Let's see, I'm gonna try that. If not morning, then I'm gonna try noon. And yeah. Cause I don't think she I don't I don't think we can see her in app in the night nighttime. Okay, this must be it, right? Yes, okay. What should I use? She's asking. <laughs> the dog is just playing with its tail. Okay. What the I mean, that was close. If the others heard me, they'd definitely chew me out for using slang on duty. Uh. For fighting alongside us. Oh, I mean, with the sand trod cleared away, supplies can reach the town again. Help yourself to a bow and arrows. Mm. My mentor has entrusted me with what feels like an impossible task. She said to stylishly decorate a weapon, but I don't. I just don't know how to approach this request. She told me to make it sparkle, and that... It must radiate burning passion, but I don't know what she's talking about. And to top it, and to top it all off, she's got an allergy to monsters, so that means monster parts won't do. Oh. If I just had a weapon, I could use as a reference for where to start. That would help a lot. So now we have a side quest. So we gotta decorate. So we gotta like 
decorate her weapons. Here, I'm gonna take a step back in case whenever I'm gonna drop things out. All right, I got a lot of rubies, so. So my game guy tells me to bring out a ruby. Here, drop it. Uh, I think I could use... Hmm. Let, let's see. Uh, I'm gonna try. <laughs> let's try this way. Alright, burning passion, so... What about this? This is the... the... Mm -hmm. <gasps> Hold on, give me a moment to study this weapon. Ooh. So if you attach a ruby like this, huh. that sparkle and the weapon positively radiates with burning passion. Even I could make something out like this, and I will certainly please my mentor for showing me such an inspired decoration. Please take this. And we got ourselves the electric keys we Thank you. Oh. It's the material I would recommend for decorating weapons. Monsters are often waking up around now, so normally I wouldn't recommend going out into the desert. However, if you want to test the strength of a weapon you've added something to, now is a perfect time. Alright. Decorate with passion is complete. Yes. Even though I probably have, like, other... No. I thought it would have another passion weapon. Wonder, am I okay to open the chest? All right, the answer is yes. So I got 10 arrows. Yep. And this one I get another Gerudo bow. I got so many duplex bow. Uh, I don't know. I think I'll get rid- I guess I'll get rid of one of the duplex bow. Since I have a lot. So, however, I want to make sure I carry the- the I want to keep the duplex or something. Alright, so what I want to do is I wanted to come make myself way to the Garuda Canyon Stable as I'm just gonna like, I th let's see here, I think my game, guy my game guy tells me to like come right here around I'm assuming, but I'll find out. Right now let's go to the, the Garuda Canyon for, for the stable. So here I am. Now I'm gonna be heading to the the stable right now. Let's see. Let's see what we can do about this one. Will I ever clean all this up? That's what it asks. Okay, I think I'll. I think I'm gonna blow this. Or, no, I'm just gonna use a fire. Yeah. I'll just use a fire. I probably could have used, like, a, the rod instead, but it's okay. I'm sure it still works. Oh, I'm g good job making it in here. You're up in about awfully dearly. I mean, it's impressive that you came all this way, but the stable has closed its door for good. Thanks to the ex extreme weather, almost no one's right through here. We get ever... We get very few visitors of any sort. Making those worse, Princess Zelda gave the order that everyone had to stay away from our well. But we need that water, not to mention the mushrooms that grow inside it. It's only temporary, it'll help. She said, I'll be right back to fix it. She said, and then she completely abandoned us. <laughs> You're saying Princess Zelda will seal the well to keep monsters from coming out of it? To save the stable? I'm ashamed of myself for even imagining that she would abandon us. She really did have our best interests at heart. Mm. Come to think of it, we did have a surge in monster sightings after building the well that only ended up once it was sealed off. But I was so busy cleaning up the stable, I never even considered that they might be connected. Uh. Thank you for looking into it for me. Next time I see Princess Zelda, I'll be sure to thank her too. Oh. As for me, I've got a mountain of junk to clear out, so I'll get back to it. Can't leave a mess when I close things down. But... Just how am I going to deal with all this stuff? So, Plath packed away. So that's our side quest. So I wonder if, whoa, whoa, that's a lot. Okay. I guess maybe I could just, uh, let's see. 
Maybe I could just do, maybe I could do it this way. It is hot. It's the only way I, we can burn this up. But this is like a lot of box. I wonder if this is why he wants to like clean everything up. Because if that's the case, I'm just gonna do my best to like clear everything. Because I think he's I think he's mentioning about wanting to, about cleaning this box up. So I thought maybe maybe burn it to destroy it would help. Which I'm doing that right now. But yeah, we're like almost done. Oh yeah, look how much it burns. And I think we are now done, right? I don't see any boxes around. Alright, let's see. Uh. Sorry, but I need to focus on cleaning this place up for now. <gasps> Whoa, all the junk is just gone? I wasn't sure what you were up to truth be told, but clearly it was all part of masterfully removing that junk. Mm -hmm. You saved me, thank you. I sort of let the junk pile build and build until it blocked the entrance, which was a real problem. There's still some work to be done, but thanks to you, I can get out of this place. That said, given that I'm wearing the uniform and this stable is still standing would be my final customer. Oh. Okay, welcome to Gerudo Canyon Stable. You, sir, have the honor of being the very last guest this stable will ever have. And that dear customer deserves commemoration in the form of one pony point. Well, that appears to be the end of my time as a stable hand. It's been a pleasure, sir, and I sincerely hope your journey ahead is fruitful one. Now then, I still have a little more junk to clear away, so I'd better get back to it. Thank you again for all your help. Oh. Hmm. Oh, I forgot about those. The stable association sent us those frames a while back. Oh. They just sort of got buried under all the junk. So I'm, let me just take off that wrapping. Hmm. They're even nicer than I thought. Maybe a little art on the walls would be nice, just so the stable's final days will, don't have to be so lonely. So there you go, Pyfe packed away is complete. So let's see, I think we're gonna help out with that. So I think where we're gonna be going is... I think somewhere here. I'm gonna guess somewhere there that I'm gonna be hanging to. Because if that's the case, if that's the case to do so. Uh, oh yeah, I have a star up there. Uh, actually, delete this pendant. Uh, I'll, I'm just gonna like teleport myself up top of the sky where the shrine is. So here I am, let's see what we can do about this. I'm gonna clip, the, clip out my camera because this is when we can start take the pictures. So let's go ahead and do this right now. As I'm, you know, I'm just using my game guide I like usually am using. So yes, this must, so I think Okay, I can take the Azone charge. Yeah, there you go. So I'll go ahead and take a picture like this. Why not? Maybe I should have talked to him about this and, and then we'll see. We'll see. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna find out and see if, if, if I'm supposed to talk to him about the picture like that. I'll be honest with you, I think I should have talked to him first before I do this part, because he'll probably um, mention something about... He'll probably mention something about what the... What he's going to be talking about, what he wants to have on this picture frame. So let's see, I think it's either on... So let's see, it's either on those two, so... I'll... Let's see here. Oh. 
Thank you for helping me with the cleaning. We're closed. So obviously we can't offer you a laundry, but you're welcome to shelter from the weather in here. Yep, just stand around passing the time until the weather clears. Come on, Blab. You could have left at least one bed out. Oh well. Alright. Wait, what if I look at this? Ah! Ah, Link, has the empty frame cut your eye? Okay, there you go. Wow, the boxes are like coming back again. Mm -hmm. I was so focused on cleaning up, so I completely forgot about these frames the Stable Association sent me. I owe this stable a lot. After all the good years it's given me, I'd like to put up something nice so it can go out in style. You know, I heard an interesting story from a retail traveler who stopped by here ah. once. There's the local attraction there by Special Rock. Just check your map. The place is famous. And this traveler told me that while they were flying over Special Rock, they glanced down and saw it smiling. <laughs> That's what I want to frame. What could be better than sending the stable off with a smile? It's just a shame that I can't fly to capture that view for myself. Aww. But if I had even, but if I had even a picture of the smiley spectacle rock, I could copy it for the frame and cheer things up in here. Which I have one. What's that? You have a picture of the smiley spectacle rock? Here's a picture. I did have one. Ah. This is exactly the picture I asked for. This is really living up the look around here. Is it, is it okay if I paint a copy? Sure. Ooh. Thank you. It really does look like it's smiling. Hehe. <laughs> Every time I look at it, I smile too. <laughs> Things got a little lonely around here once the stable closed, but having this here makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside. Now just give me a moment to whip up a rip and duck shit. Ha ha ha. Don't worry, I'm quite a good at this. I promise. Alright. So we're gonna get this. Nice. So we got one picture down. I knew it. It's perfect for the stable. And it's all thanks to you, Link. To show my appreciation, I'm giving you one pony point. Oh yes, yeah, so please take this too. This dish is a staple speciality. And we got the chili mushroom risotto. Yes, yes. I knew this sight would be just the thing to cheer me up. Reminds me of when this place was full of smiles. Still, if you ever have a different picture of Spectacle Rock smiling, I'd be happy to copy it down and put it instead. Or put it up instead, I mean. Just let me know when you want to see something else in this lovely frame. Alright. So, that, so that's probably... Oh yeah, a picture for the closed stable one. So I just completed that. So I'm gonna look at this ah. one. So this is gonna be the, the second one that we're gonna be uh, doing. It turns out the Stable Association sent me two frames by mistake, kind of ironic, or ironic, given we're about to close. But far be, be it from me to look a gift horse in the mouth, I might as well use the other frame to bid the Stable Fair unstable. I think a picture of a giant sword stuck into a peak in the Gruta Highlands is the neat goodbye the Stable deserves. Aww. It's just northwest of here, but I won't be able to go see it. I have cleaning to do. Besides, it's cold in the Gruta Highlands. Even a copy picture of the giant sword would live up this old pe old place. All right, which I'm gonna which I'm gonna help out. Let me go ahead and do this one, and I need to put on the let's put on the snow boot and a cold resistance outfit on. So it's r it's right there. So I'll teleport myself to the Gruta Highland and. Get us to find a giant sword. I got my head thinking about the Legend of Zelda giant, giant sword. I don't know. I thought it'd be funny, to tell you the truth. I thought it'd be really funny for this. All right. I probably should have like, uh, maybe I should have just, uh, just fly up, take a dive, but. I think, but it's okay. I think I can just, I could just go up there without having trouble. All right. So we just need to climb all the way up top. I'm gonna get the camera out, so that way when I see a a giant sword, we can get a picture. I think the I think the part that I gotta be careful is the dragon because 
Because the dragon is gonna be somewhere up top. Wait, did I, s I th Oh, I thought I saw something that's falling, but... But oh well, I don't see it. I'll go equip this. Oh yeah, it actually helps. Okay. Or maybe I should have like... Oh yeah, I also have... To... Oh, I actually got two. Oh god, that scared the heck out of me! Oh my gosh, that scared the heck out of me. I thought it was gonna be the wind. I thought there was gonna be a wind. Oh yes, there you go. Thank you guys. Oh my gosh, that scared the heck out of me. I thought it was gonna I thought it would be like a, a wind that could help me go up, but but I was wrong about that. Okay, I should have like there you go. Alright. Yeah, I could see him on falling. I think this would be the good option to do. Okay, whatever, it's falling down. Okay. The answer will be right there. And I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get rid of this. You know, it's fine. Alright. There you go. I do not want to get bothered by it. Okay, re- Nope, I actually wanted to do- No, stop! What am I doing? Recall. There you go. This one here is the recall that I wanted to do. Alright, yes. There it is! Right there. Actually, wrong one. Clip the camera. Okay, I, I'm pretty nervous about this. Okay, I... Oh gosh, dang it. I thought I could just... Okay, well, I'm just gonna take a picture. Okay, I don't care. I'm just gonna take a picture. Now let's get out of here, go back to the canyon stable. Okay, let's just get out of here. So we don't have to worry about fighting it. Whew, that was close. I thought I was going to have to get into a fight with the... The Gilok That I was going to be heading to. So let me go ahead and put back my own style like I usually have. So let me do this right now. Alright, let's use the two lens wind for this. I don't see why not that I could take the the rush room. Thank you. Yeah, it's weird that the boxes just started to keep coming back. All right, let's talk to you. So, uh, you're back. You're really back. Oh, it's good to see another face around here. Thank you so much. Now, how can I help? Let's frame a picture. Aha, this is exactly the picture I asked for. This would really live up the book around here. Is it okay if I paint a copy? Sure. Uh. Thank you. So this is a giant sword, huh? It's so much bigger than I ever imagined. <laughs> I knew it was out there, but finally getting my eyes on it. Wow, just wow. Now just give me a moment to whip up a what production. Haha, <laughs> don't worry. I'm quite good at this, I promise. Alright, we'll get to painting going. So we can just... Just do whatever. Alright. I knew it! It's perfect for this stable, and it's all thanks to you, Link. To show my appreciation, I'm giving you one pony point. Ah. Oh yes, and please take this too. This dish is a stable speciality. And got myself a spicy mushroom ah. roasto risotto. I have to tell you, this is the last of the paintings to go out with this bit of art. All the staples have been decorated. And from what I hear, it was you who helped get pictures uh, put on the walls of the other stables too, Link. As as a way of saying thanks for all your help, I'd like to give you a gift from the Staple Association. Please take it. And that is a diamond. Ah. I have this for you too. Ah, oh, hold on. It doesn't seem like you have room in your pouch. 
I was thinking of sending five servings of our staples on speciality dish with with you, uh -huh. but I hate not being able to thank you properly after you've done so much for us. I'll give you a gift once you've made from room to carry it. Just come see me when you're ready. Okay, if I... <laughs> okay, so I don't have enough room. Okay. Wait, what are you talking about? I only, I have two. I guess he just wants me to like... You know what? Hold on. I'm gonna like... I'm just gonna place a travel medallion here. I think I'm gonna sell stuff to Beetle, probably other stable. I'm gonna do that, so I will see you guys in a minute. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Let's see if I I already trade some of that I don't need. Okay, let's see. Uh -huh. Okay, are you here to pick up your reward for helping put the picture in the stable frames? Uh, yes, then here it is. A token to show our thanks. So we got five enduring carrot cake. Oh, that looks so yummy. It has a stamina to help. Ooh. I'm happy to swap the painting in the frame for a different one. If you have an image I, you like, please just let me know. Uh -huh. Thank you for a truly splendid picture. Please feel free to use this table whenever you want. And we have completed the side quest with uh, another closed stable. Uh, we are actually about to be finishing up the side quest. I think that's going to happen next episode. Alright, collect. I think I'm at 131 or 30 something, I don't know. I'm not so sure, but I'm really happy, excited that we're about to be finishing up the side quest. I think next episode is going to be the final side quest. Or maybe the other different parts of episodes for the side quest. I'm just going to do this to burn the boxes. I wanted it to. I'll do the same thing with that. Even that one too. Who needs a boxes? Alright, come on. Toasty Chill Shroom. Thanks. I'll be taking them. Alright, come on. There we go. Now he won't have boxes inside anymore. Alright. Well, what a, that was like a pretty adventure episode we're having. Like they're like we're we're getting close to be finishing up this side quest now. After this, then then all we have to do is the Koroks. So this is exciting. So, thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this. If you do, please do me a favor, drop a like for this video. If you are new to my channel and haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and hit a subscribe button. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so y'all can be notified on when I can post videos on YouTube. Feel free to leave a comment down below, and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye!